it's such an amazing thing to be able to see through the curtains of physicality and to penetrate into the deeper deepest layers of our existence that are all made out of love made out of truth made out of inner connection to the spiritual realm of reality to remove to peel off and to take away the husks and the coverings of the dark side of our creation and to get into that deepest most sweet and satisfying healing and reviving source of life that is inside any cell and particle of creation and the most beautiful thing is that really even though that there are very hard and complex hours in our reality still it is in our potential to break through and to find the essence and the inner connection to the source of life to our maker himself in any moment of our lives and even if we are failing sometimes in remembering him and understanding that it's all part of a gigantic puzzle we can remind ourselves that our failure is not an evident for any kind of lacking in his great godly supervision because there were and there still are true righteous people that were and are able to stand in very hard tests and not to lose their faith and not to let go of their connection to our maker even in the worst unbelievable hard hours challenging times in their lives and even in the darkest hours they were able to penetrate and to go through those curtains of camouflage and plasters of physicality that are blocking the godly light of reality and we by believing in those righteous ones by following their footsteps can find sparks that will wake up our minds to take brave decisions and to get deeper on our own even though we find it hard to compare ourselves to those huge pillars of light to those gigantic leaders of our nation or the world but like we know Moshe Rabbeinu the main prophet that opened the eyes of the world to see the unity and oneness of our maker with his people he said to the whole world in his speech to the people of Israel and said you are meant to know Hashem means that Moshe explained to the people that were close to him that they have the ability to access into places that are beyond their reach because of their connection and closeness to him the fact that you have friends in higher hierarchies that you have connection to righteous ones that are able to walk on clouds that are able 
to make changes in heaven's court that able to communicate and to uplift you to high levels of awareness that are able to bring down enormous amounts of light from our maker by their merit and by our connection to them we can achieve great tremendous high in level and in quality achievements so we should bond ourselves to the true righteous ones to the real amazing authentic honest truthful loving kind and inspiring sources of lights that are shining in our world to connect ourselves to them and through them to higher levels to deep and amazing places that only godliness is shining in great light over there and we can bring down buckets of light based on our connection to those amazing foundations of the world the righteous ones that were ready to sacrifice themselves in the hardest times in times of judgments in times of harsh harsh decrees in times of pain and physical darkness in times of fire times of smoke thunders and lightnings in times of poverty times of plagues times of drought storms and all kinds of challenges and difficulties they were able to throw themselves into the darkness into the fire into the storm because they believed and understood that Hashem is over there that Hashem is beyond behind the curtain and waiting always in any situation mm -hmm. for us to reach out to him so based on those teachings that we're receiving from those righteous ones we are able to grow and to communicate in higher levels and by that to bring down those buckets of bounty to our loved ones to the ones that depends on us as we depends on the righteous ones and like branches of the tree one is receiving from the other one is receiving from the other and you have your spot and we have our place so you should be happy with your place and to shine the light to those branches that depends on you and to keep on pulling and enjoying wisdom love and connection from those branches that are feeding and nurturing you may this light and this blessing of shine and glow will heal us completely and bring us to a new stage in reality new level of awareness higher and and holy mindset of always being connected to our maker always to develop and strengthen our connection to all the souls that are on the same mission on the same route towards the city of Yerushalayim towards the temple of Hashem towards the time of redemption great salvation walking hand in hand all nations united together as one in all the bodies that ever lived on earth beyond time in the time of resurrection of the dead everyone walking together beyond place free from all kinds of limitations free from all kinds of darkness and constrictions we shall find ourselves marching to Yerushalayim to see the face of our maker introduced to him again by the true Mashiach the king of nations the king of people that will crown the king of the universe the king of the world Hashem the maker of this creation and he will crown him and we will crown him 
and everyone will support each other in great honor in great ways that will be revealed to us will teach us and will open our minds to understand our true potential ways of true connection through faith through prayer and through holy intentions and will be able like we said to bring down those buckets of light buckets of bounty buckets of tremendous growth and healing for all our loved ones so believe in yourselves that you are able to achieve great things and that there are souls that depends on you too so connect yourselves to the ones that are feeding you and supporting you and by that you'll be able to support and feed others may the light of hashem eternal light of goodness shine upon us to heal us strengthen us stabilize us and give us all our needs for the next step of our mission to shine that light to the next levels to the next floors that depends on us and may it take place in our days in our time amen can you hear thank you